happy time like Jamie Foxx. <laughs> <laughs> um, you know what? Some people touched on this already, so I'm kind of going to this one. Um, he don't look for beef. But he's from the belly of the beast. And the nigga got to eat. So he's out here like a bully on these streets. And it's hard to be scared of the sergeant when you starve. When you got three kids in a two-room apartment, you stay down for whatever. Right. You take chances with no second guessing. Now CNN keeps saying the U.S. in a recession, which ironically translates to the hood in a Great Depression. <laughs> now Obama, he ain't Teddy Roosevelt. And you can tighten your belt until the leather break. Just like the levy break. When you hungry, you make a nigga levitate for the crumbs on his plate. Come on, come on, come on. You get to think, if I take his cake, then I can have mine and eat it too. And I don't mean to be rude, but hunger pains tend to put people in bad moods. Tend to put mud shots on the news. A regular dude right. whose dude's been paid, but his chance been put in escrow, and he can't let go. So he kisses his wife. Mm. He grabs his iron. Mm. He tells his boys, mm. let's go. <laughs> See, his bank book is in the red. He's stuck in a white legal system and living with the Ill Street Blues. Now you mix those hues, and it's plain to see that his issues is American. When your stomach is growling, it makes it easy to serve heroin. And if you can remove the stomach pains by moving cocaine, then Burger King becomes a synonym for dope game. Mm -hmm. Touchdowns is the same as Mary Jane. See, jump shots is the same as crack rocks to the have nots. It's all a hustle. <laughs> Whether you use using Pyrex or muscle, it's all about that profit. Even if you slang rhymes, That's what it is. nigga, you better flow narcotics. That's right. That's they say right. the root of all evil is money. They find that funny. Because in this country, chasing cash, that's the only way to make sure that you ain't hungry. Mm -hmm. What's up, sis? Try like not to drink nothing, so I don't wind up like with extra juice in my fit. All right, so you know I'm gonna go here. Um, it's a lot of sisters in here with natural hair, okay. and a lot of sisters in here with natural mind states. Okay. Okay. And this is probably this one was probably about four or five years old. It's probably been two or three years since I had no stage. So y'all can y'all bear with me? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. She said she wanted a brainwash and a pride relaxing and a simulated style and a European mindset. She was willing to finger wave goodbye to $80 weekly to achieve chemically augmented beauty. Mm -hmm. Now she's had Africa's essence. She had Africa's booty. But Europe flowed out her, through her mind and out her scalp. She viewed her trip to the beauty salon as a necessary evil, not a western thinking trap. See, she said hell no to the afro, would rather not rock the Zulu knots. She gave props to the sisters with dreadlocks, but said that's a game she could never play. She'd rather sit in the stands and watch. Mm -hmm. She felt ugly without dark and love. Come on. Didn't feel she could floss in the face of haters unless she used cream of nature. So every summer oh. Saturday, it was a good bet that she'll be somewhere underneath the hot ass hair dryer trying not to sweat. Right. <laughs> in fact, <laughs> so every summer Saturday, so every summer Saturday, it was a good bet that she'll be somewhere underneath the hot ass hot hair dryer trying not to sweat. Mm -hmm. wow. In fact, she never wanted to sweat. Never wanted to let perspiration ruin the perm she paid so much to get. Mm -hmm. In fact, she stood packed. Even though she felt she was getting fat, she said, they need exercises like suicide when your churches are treated with guanadine hydroxide. <laughs> Pool parties and beach trips, she stood dot side, far enough away not to be splashed on if you walk by. If you even thought about drifting on her, she looked at you with a cocked eye. Now, I, being the man that I am, I had issues with her. See, my problem is, I never saw most of relaxing on ice. I love the fro I saw on Angela Davis, and I think the. I love the fro I love the fro I saw on Angela Davis, and I think dreadlocks on a black woman is priceless. To her, I expressed this. And she looked at me dead in my mouth. She gave me that beautiful black woman look that screamed, Nigga, what the fuck is you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> so, 
who then proceeded to read me. She stripped my pro blackness and exposed my conditioning like come it was on. easy. Come on, man. Let me see, JG. I done known you for a couple of years, at least three, and every girl I done seen you wear hair is long and wavy. Right. Hey, how you gonna right. pay me? Right. I sit right next to you when you watch BET. Right. And some silly right. air, baby, right. you drive me crazy. Oh, oh. And all the queens that you drool over in them King magazines have had the screams of mixed parents. What? Uh, Let's not make this a one-sided thing. Yeah, get it together. See, Come the on. truth is, brother, I'm black. And if I let my hair nap, <laughs> Just like you today, I'm here checking for that. Damn, it hit me like a slap. Come on, come on, come on. But it come took on. me back to a scene. Had I been hypnotized as a youth watching Liz Taylor play an African queen? Come now, on. Now, why not treat the Willie Gilbert type so supreme? Uh -huh. See, my ex man wishes the public enemy dreams have been crushed. Because I didn't realize that ISO plus, ISOs, just us. Mm -hmm. Wow. Mm -hmm. okay. ah. And my public enemy dreams have been crushed. Yes, they have. Because I didn't realize that ISO plus, ISOs, just us. Mm -hmm. Got black people think that they natural hair ain't good enough. That's right. And TCB mm -hmm. must mean teaching colors bullshit. <laughs> and I don't know how we let this slide. This is a product the strippers of our blackness, what they call it African pride. Now, it may take the doctor miracle, but if we truly wish to achieve African hair, we may have to take the relaxers the fuck up out of our head. I did bring my CD with me. Yes, you did. Um, $10. And you know, holla at me after on the break. And I'm going to finish off this piece and we get back to the show. Is that cool? Yeah. I love Cincinnati. I just want to know that. Yeah. 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 Hey, have a request. <laughs> no, because then I have a request. I didn't know she looked. I didn't know she looked. You know what? There's a lot of nice looking people in here. There's probably going to be a lot of sex had tonight. I'm going to help you out. I'm going to help you out. I'm going to help you out. With my words, pour you like bricks, then I'll lick you from the bowl. Okay. Ah. And just to make sure I don't miss shit, mm. I'm gonna take my time. And I'm gonna sock you up with a fist. <laughs> now I know I can't make cakes like yours with biscuit. So I'm gonna go slow. I'm gonna stir you up with this dick. Okay. Wow. <laughs> and this is over easy. This is easy like Sunday morning. Uh -huh. yes. I'm going to serve you a warm plate of orgasms while your breath still sticks and you're still yawning. Yeah. Yeah. Breakfast in bed. I don't need no frying pan for this. The sun is beating. This is a hot buttered solstice. I intoxicate you like mimosas. I rise with the speed of pop tarts. I cover your breast like each nipple is covered in jam. The red light just came on. You Krispy Kreme. Oh. Therefore, I am. When I enter your space, I cinnamon roll. And then I place my chocolate crepe in a place the size of a donut hole. You see those other guys, they've been egg McMuffins. They empty calories, they burn, they nothing. I said those other guys, they egg McMuffins. They empty calories, baby girl, they nothing. My meals are whole. I scatter, cover, and smother all of your sensitive body parts. So many endorphins in your blood, I'm like Starbucks for your heart. Sweeter than any cereal made by Post. A syrupy French kiss, flavor like French toast. And you crack your legs like eggs. Hey. Uh oh, wow. <laughs> Girl, crack your legs like eggs. Hey. Girl, crack your legs 
like eggs. Line your stomach. Now put your hips sunny side up. Yeah. Now enjoy. As I scramble your brains and pancake my hips into your butt. Now it's you ah. being rough. Ah. But all I'm going to do is beat. And besides, when I subside, you'll be so happy that you drip your cream with wheat. Ah. You see that? And besides, when I subside, oh, you'll be happy that you drip your cream with weeds. See, I'm all-star special. So when I hit that grand slam, ain't no need for you to say thanks, man. <laughs> My apologies to you for interrupting your snoring. But this is the only way that I know how to say good morning. Good morning.